Welcome to my channel, Planning with Maserati. What I'm going to be doing today is setting up my personal size recollections planner, this gorgeous color, and adding in some recollections inserts. I do have other planners, you know, similar to my setup, but I just wanted to set this one up. I don't know. I'm getting bored in the house. So in here, I already have inserts that I'm going to take out and then I'm going to be adding in new ones and adding in some from the old ones. So as you can see, this is the six ring binder personal. You have your pen loop here. You have your list pad here, or you could, you have a pocket here, a pocket here, and this is one of the older Recollections. You have three pockets here for card slots, a nice pocket here, and a pocket here. And when you close it up, it looks like this. So it does give you a big enough strap. And yeah, they do that thing. But as you can see, it gives you a big enough strap just in case you want to make it chunky. Not really wanting to make it chunky, but I do want it to, you know, like sits better. So if you do a little bit of this and like bend it in, you'll kind of get it to go flat. And the more you do that, the more you structure, you know, you're like moving it around a little bit. It'll start to lay, see, it'll start to lay flat. So with that being said, let's get into this. And again... I don't know if I said before we start, welcome, please subscribe, hit that post notification bell. I'm sorry if I'm repeating myself. Give it a big thumbs up, leave a comment, and share the video. So let's really begin. So I have this one here, which is the Creative Year Insert Pack. Should be 51 pieces. And then I have the um, another Insert Pack with 51 pieces. So this one here... It really doesn't say like what it is, but we're just going to use what we have here. So again, think big, 51 pieces, and this UPC. So let's open this up. Take this bad boy out. And these are great inserts. So like we have weekly events. You don't have to have events. You can... Use it as a weekly page because it is just weekly, it looks like. So let's see what we have in here. Okay, so the first few pages is your weekly page, which is good because you can put the month and the week. And then the same thing with the backside. So it looks like that. So we're going to definitely put this one in first. And then this one just says think big. So we're going to add that one into it. And now you'll see other inserts. So I don't want them all to be in the same divider. So I'm going to grab, and this is garbage now. Uh, okay, where's the garbage can? Found it. Um, I'm going to grab another divider, just a plain one. Just go foiling. And again, I'm going to show you this before I toss it. So this has, let's see, the weekly events. Let's go back into here so you can see it because it's a little different than what I'm thinking. So think big, the weekly events. You'll notice the color is in black and white. And on the back side, it's in like a goldish bronze. So that is all those. The next set is your to-dos, which is the same exact thing. So you'll have it like this with a little floral on the bottom. And on the back side, it's just the to-do and the goldy bronze looking thing. Looking thing. And we're going to grab all of those out. Okay. Let's open this up again. And again, this is good for having just a few of each. So you're not overwhelming yourself. Actually, I should have put this one first, which is the first tab. So I'm going to switch this one out. Where it's the think big. Put 
that one there and I'm going to switch this one out which is just the bronzy looking one or no the gold foiling and then now I can do the next one and I do not like opening the rings for this reason sometimes the paper does not want to cooperate so sorry if it looks like it's so far down I don't know why okay there you go so now you can see the edge so the next one I'm gonna grab it says believe the very best And for that one, it says important dates. Um, I'm going to most likely do this for goals. Because, I mean, I don't have important events. And I said dates. So it's important events. So event description, event date, important dates, and finished. And it's the same thing on the back side. Except it says ideas and don't forget. And month, date, and year. So I'm going to kind of use this for maybe a YouTube kind of thing. Um, next you have contacts, but I'm not going to close the planner just yet. So if you have any contacts, you just have your name and phone number. You can always do like address or whatever. That's your contacts and supplies needed. So whenever you need supplies. Um, but I'm going to kind of like vamp it up the way I like it. I'm looking for more dividers and I only have this one left. So we're going to do this one next. And I may not keep all these sheets in here. I'm just trying them out. The next set, which should be the end of it, is your notes and thoughts. And these are always perfect. And it says be curious on the back side. So we're going to put that there in the back. The next one we're going to grab is the, again, the creative year. We're going to toss this because it does have dividers. And that's what I need. Besides, I need some more dividers. Okay, and then that's this one here. Again, 51 pieces. I don't need that kind of well. That went in my closet almost. How many dividers does this one come with? This one only comes with one divider. So we'll just do best day ever. I'm gonna leave the thoughts in the back. And this one comes with my top moments. Okay, is this a page? Okay. So my top moments, one through 10. Again, you don't have to use it for that. And then in the back, the set by thing. So you, again, you don't have to use it for that. It's in, in, inspirational quotes, actually. Who said what? So we're going to just put this back here. I'm not really needing that right away. Um, the next set, it says, today I did. And you got one through 20 and it says lovely. And again, I'm just going to put these in the back. Ideas, don't forget. Because right now, it's not needed. But I want to have it just in case I want it. Um, reasons to be. Happy, excited, thoughtful, energized. Um, creative, healthy, imaginative, imaginative, and compassionate. Again, it's going to go in the back. And then, last night I dreamed... And again, this is not going to be what it's supposed to be. Because, I mean, I don't remember my dreams. Last night I dreamed, date, and whatever. So this is going to be just washi taped and filled in. So, And again, sketch it out. Dream could be whatever. So I'm going to use this one before anything else. And then I'm going to put this in the back which is again notes and thoughts and this one just says stay humble now I do have a lot more sheets that now we can fill in I have to do's I have budgets and I have some more notes and thoughts again like I said I may not leave all this in here 
I kind of want to use this as my cash envelope system. So I am just trying to see what I like and how I like this. So I like to take the paper together so that they don't get messed up because I don't have a page lifter in the back. So we're going to start in the beginning where it says um, weekly events. Now that could be your weekly to-do list or, you know, whatever you choose. So this one is garbage. Okay. And let's see what we have in here. We have some papers. We have to-dos. Weekly nutrition. Now see, this is what I need. I don't have somewhere to put right now my meals. But I don't want to focus on goals. Okay. Um, I don't know, because this is the weekly fitness one, and I'm not really wanting to use this just yet. I do want to use the back side where it's, the front side where it says breakfast, lunch, and dinner. But the back side says the fitness. And you have to-dos, grid paper, and line paper. So let's see what we have here. To-dos, notes and thoughts, a bunch of notes and thoughts. So let's do the budget. Um, let's see, I have a budget planner already. I don't feel like taking this apart. Because I already have, you know, the budget planner. And then the to-dos are more of a goal setting, my list. To buy his appointments, activities. This is not kind of like what I'm looking for as a to-do. So let's go grab another planner. This is not what I want, what I want in there. So now we're gonna grab this one, which I'll probably just take all this stuff off. This is too small of a ring set. I do like it though. This is my Kate Spade. And I already have it all decoed. Oh, decisions, decisions. This one has life begins. Just some pretty stuff. Some deco, some pockets. What I may end up doing is just taking some of that out of there. And just adding to here. I don't know because I love my Kate Spade. Oh, I'm so confused. So should I just store them in here, put them in here? But I kind of have everything I need in here. Oh my gosh, I'm so confused. Because I'm not using it as a planner yet. Yet, I do have pretty deco on it. And like I put Joyce Myers on the back. Life begins after coffee. So I'm just trying to see how I want to use this. See, I have the monthly insights. Reasons to be. So what I'm thinking of doing is this section's fine. Um, goals and ideas is fine. See, I have my top moments. Some inserts that I'm working on. My to-dos. The stay humble. See, I have it all in here already. So, yeah. so what I'm going to do is stay into this one. Because I do, I do like it. I like this one a lot. It just doesn't close. Or should I just stick it into this one and just have it close? Hmm. Decisions, decisions. This is like a planner problem for me. Um, I don't know what size rings these are compared to this one. They look the same. But this one just has more functionality. And I wanted to use this one more if as a... Uh, what do you call it? Money envelope system. I love that one. That is so cute. 
And then I have my habits in here. I'm going to stick to this one because of the reason being this is already set up the way I like it. But I do want to add from here into here, take some of this out and put into here. And this is going to be my storage. Got it. So again, we're going to take this one out. And that is going to be my first divider. I have a first divider in there, but it's not what I want. Okay. As long as this closes, let me see. Because a lot of this is going to come. Do you see how it's like, did it even close? Yeah, it's closed. Do you see how this is not the same size? I want it to be the same size. So what I'm going to do is move some stuff out, put it in here, move some stuff in, put it in here. Make any sense? Probably not. Okay, so we're going to use this side with this side. So you can see both sides. Kate Spade, Recollections. Kate Spade won. Recollections lost. Okay, so the first one I have, and I did all this and didn't even realize I don't even like the setup of this one. It looks too plain. Monthly insights. Okay, I like that as my monthly page. Um, top 10 things I need to do this month. I like that. And I'm not even utilizing this section. So this is ridiculous. Reason to be, and I want to set up another planner. Seriously. So what I'm going to do is leave one month at a time in here and remove okay so what is this one reasons to be and remove this one i'm actually gonna leave this one here as the checklist and i'm gonna put this one on the side here for now i'm gonna leave one of these dreams things but it's not gonna be for dreams again it's gonna be for something totally different and I'm going to leave ideas because ideas could stay the way it is. And I'm going to remove all of these. Okay. Makes more sense to me. I'm going to leave the pocket. But I do want to put a weekly event in here. So I'm going to grab another divider. Think big. So you're going to get the gist of what I'm doing. And I'm going to put two weekly events in here. And on the back side, it's just, again, weekly events. So technically, I should have four, three, right? Because it's almost like five weeks in a month. So I'm going to put that on that side and put this on this side. So that's that. To do's. I have a section, I think, for to do's. So now goals. How many do I have in here? Because I don't need all of these. I'm going to leave two in here. And I'm going to remove all of these. Which is only two. This I'm going to leave in here because this is a monthly thing that I'm working on. My top ten moments. How many do we have? See, I don't like... I don't like all that. Today I did... I did. Okay, so we're gonna leave just these two are gonna come out. Again, reasons to be happy can stay. Do you see how what I'm doing is downsizing this one? And I'm going to put it into here so you can see it. So everything I'm removing from here is going into here. This section is going to go into here if need be. So you have creative, happy, excited, thoughtful, energized. That can stay. And you only need one. Okay. So now these can come out. And then you have your notes and thoughts. Which I am going to remove all of this. Because if you see what I have, I have a whole bunch of sections not sectioned out. So I have notes and then to-dos all together. That shouldn't be. Notes should be separate from to-dos. So we are going to go into here and grab another divider. 
which I have tons of recollection dividers. And this section is going to be my notes and thoughts, and I'm only going to do a few. So then these can go back here. And then what I have left out of here, I'm going to go back into the beginning, is your to-dos. Now, this one needs a different divider. So I'm going to grab another divider. And I want to have a lot of dividers. And less mess. And I kind of like... Where's that other to-do at? Does this make any sense to you? I kind of like that to-do, but then I have these to-dos. Okay, so what I'm going to do is... Because I do like these to-dos better I am going to take these to do why are some pages corner around it some pages not and these are all recollections stick all these to do's and there's a lot of them and I'm only gonna grab a few of these so let me grab just a couple maybe like three because you get front and back there you go how many did I grab I grabbed three so front to do's and then the back to do's so that works out perfect it gives it a little upgrade from these and I feel like they hole punched them weird because if you look at the hole punch look at how close they went to the page compared to like everything else so I feel like these were hole punched weird okay so now we're done with these to do's and now we have notes and thoughts but I already have that, so I'm not worried about that. What's on the back side of that? Ooh, it would help to close it. So notes and thoughts is the stay humbled. And what is this one? Be curious. And I probably do have some of those in here anyway. And be curious right there. See? So I have the be curious and the stay humble. And again, I only need three. And it doesn't really matter. Okay, so then the next section it was the to-dos. So we don't need that. We have a pocket. And then I have these do not worry list pads. And all I'm going to do is leave three in here and take this out. Because I don't need all this paper. Not all at once. You got to start using it before you can start putting a lot of stuff in there and then I have this list pad which has a lot that I, this little cute one that I hole punched cut hole punch cut so again three sheets only is gonna stay in here this rust is gonna go out into here so do you see what I'm doing is I'm just like updating it where I know what I need and what I don't need. So let's see how it's closing. It is closing better. I'm noticing a little bit of a difference. Okay. So I like that. Now we're going to get it into this he said, she said stuff. My top moments. And I think I already have that, if I'm not mistaken. Uh, my top 10 moments or something. Reasons to be happy, top 10 things, notes and thoughts. And it could be just me thinking I have it. Dreams, and then I have my next divider, which is the weekly events. I still need to get some pretty stuff in here, though. My top 10 moments, I do have that right there. So I don't need that. So that can come out. And look at it, it's corner around it. It's weird. And then when I get done with this, I'll later on organize this one better because I have to add more stuff. And then this is the Agenda 52. Yes, it does not match the dividers. And it doesn't match the pockets. If you notice, this pocket is bigger than the paper. And I am okay with that. I just like having pockets in here for like junk and stuff. Um, this we already seen. This we already seen. We're back over here. And then I have this one, which is just full of stickers in the back. 
of what kind of stickers do I need these stickers yeah so these are like the everyday stickers that could stay this is definitely gonna stay I love these color dividers this here is nothing I think it's just a cardboard but we're gonna keep it and then starts my meal planner which I have now Monday Tuesday Wednesday I can do my you know what I need and then my grocery list so I didn't realize I had that in here and I don't need all of these I'll probably just use because you have front and back three sheets and then move this one into here and again this section will be organized better and I like the pen matches you know the aesthetic of you know the black and the pink and then you have this here I am on 25 minutes and that was for setting that up so I apologize and then I love that matches that and that was not done on purpose and then this is just blank paper dot grid again we don't need all of it so you're gonna remove some and I'm gonna leave the things open because I keep popping it in and out and I think I'm gonna leave it as it is here where why is this not going in? There is something crazy going on. These three pages. Okay, there you go. That was just crazy. That gave me a headache. No. I was going to keep it closed, but you can't. For some reason, it's still thick. I love the paper. Oh, I love that paper. This one says, be positive, be grateful, live an abundant life. So I am grateful for daily devotion. I will leave probably that in there because this is the topical study. I will leave that in there. And again, I don't need all of this because I just took a lot of that out. So we are going to remove this. I don't know why I just did it like that, but we did it. We are going to remove all this. And again, if you need paper, you have a section for it. So you don't really need to be scared about, oh my God, I don't have paper in my planner because you have so much in your room and why is this not going in correctly there I'm telling you there's something wrong with that paper quality I love agenda 52 inserts I have to say that like agenda 52 inserts are the bomb and then this is just the habit tracker that I've showed before and what is this more habit trackers so I'm gonna leave the habit tracker in here and this is what I just use as my page lifter so as you can see it got a lot of it got a makeover I got a nice little makeover here and I like it it's not gonna close because of this thing here and some of the dividers but I am happy with what I did here so let's see what we have here important events I don't need at this moment I do want to take another divider out just so I have enough last night I dreamed today I did and notes and thoughts so I am good with leaving all this in here and this could be my little storage for my personal size inserts for now at least until I'm ready to use this one and this one can come in here and I think I want to put it as the beginning or no. Because I want it to be like a page like this. Just to preserve this one because that's a divider. There you go. So you, the next time you see this, this will be the pretty stuff. Um, you'll see more functionality with this. You'll see me working on it. I may do things with you with this one and yeah eventually I'll change out some of these dividers and put like the I like the clear ones I really do I like these kind of dividers from agenda 52 so then I will change out when I'm done with these recollection pages I don't think I will be purchasing any more recollections I think I will be purchasing the agenda 52 ones because I really like the quality of their paper so there you have it Thank you for watching. And one more thing before I close this out. 
I will put month, week, and the things I do together. So when you see this, this is back here and it's meal planner. But what I want it to be is up here with the first divider. Well, this is just my little page lifter. But my first divider where it has, before I close this out, my monthly insight. I want my meal planner. I want a tracker. I want my to-do, my creative side, my notes and thoughts all in one section so that every time I plan out, I'm not like, oh my God, where is everything at? I can't find it. And that is how that's going to be. So again, thank you for watching and I will talk to you in the next video. Sorry that I didn't get to change the planner, but I'm kind of happy with the setup of like how this looks together it's opened I don't have to worry about it when I close it yes it doesn't zipper but I love it like it there's no other that's gonna replace this that I found yet so thank you for watching talk to you in the next one bye bye and do you see the sign it says girl boss yeah bye bye